Hi, I'm... Hi, I'm Morak Dice. Are you done? Hi, I'm Morak Dice, and welcome back to an all-new Let's Play. We should obviously know what this is. You can see it scrolling in the background. Super... Well, no, not Super Busta Move. Busta Move 4. Classic Busta Move. I mean, you really can't expect too much. The player versus player is okay. But let's just do some basic arcade. Let's just do normal. Do I get to pick my character, or do I am I forced to play as one of them? Good. So we have Bub, and I guess Bobby is for two-player. Cleon, G, Alcanet, Marino, Bram, Devilon, Kural, which is Kermit the Frog, a cat saber, and Karapi had some sort of weird baby. Tam Tam, Gigante. Let's play Devilon. I like him the most. Oh, fancy, fancy. Well, either way, it's bust a move. I mean, it's not like a miracle. You probably played this or a copy of it on a cell phone somewhere. Let's just get rid of those. And it looks like the only feature they added was the pulley system, which is. Bayonga! Which is, eh. I mean, it's it's bust a move. Yeah, so I've tried recording this like three or four times, and it keeps having issues, and people keep texting me. Wow. Derp that one. Or reverse derp that. Oh, look at his happy little dance. He yeah. had. I am happy dance. Ugh, really? You're gonna give me a blue at the last second? You fuckers. Fuck you. Get this fucking green bullshit out of here. I hate when that happens. When it's like off timed, so it's trying to give you one of each just to throw, screw you up. Alright. If you can get it just right. Yeah! Uh, let's... Damn it. Damn it all. Double damn it. Yeah, there's no way I'm getting behind that. Mm. Let's get rid of that. And... I wonder where the cursor is. Normally there's like a little cursor that helps you kind of guide them in. This one just said, F you, man. go. Just scrap that, scrap that, and that should be... Damn it! Too low. No, these are none of the things I want. Stop giving me crap I don't want. You son of a bitch! bastard. You triple bastard. Yeah. I'll give it one more try. At least try to try to make five minutes. See, there it is. I guess it disappears if you're doing well. I don't know. Don't give me a ticking timer, jerk. Nope. Yeah, whatever. Just trash it. Although I think in the arcade game they penalize you for trashing it. I played a really sweet one in Vegas a long time ago. It had like a whole rollerball setup. It looks like it was a mixed cabinet though, it was, like not an original. Um, but it was the original. Well, it was the original Busta Move, but. Um, it had a rollerball instead of the standard uh, joystick, or they would have the the four but or two buttons. All right. See, this 
It's just weird. Like, the bouncing and physics are very strange. Like, I keep trying to think, like, pool, but since they don't have momentum, that's not a possibility. Well, that worked. Um, and wow, they gave me another one. Thanks for nothing. Jerks. Look at a little happy dance. Oh, shit. You bastards. I thought that was the end. whoops a doo Yep, moving on. Yep, so here's like the gimmick of the entire game. Oops. I mean, it's neat, I guess. I mean, unfortunately, it's not, like, the greatest. Well, shit, fuck. I know you're upset. Yep. Wow, that... Uh, the last time, eh? Because I've recorded this three or four times. Normally, uh, those don't reach all the way to the bottom, but I get this one is just, like... Yep, vengeance time. I don't want that damn cursor. Why it's being a bastard and not giving me the cursor. Why is the whole thing shaking? Come on. There you go. This ticked movement is terrible. So let's get rid of the purple. I know. That upsets you. Ugh. Alright, well, whatever. It's boss to move. If I was uh, paying more attention, I'd probably be a little better. And also, the little cursor thing not being there is really confusing. I'm not sure if that's something that's just broken. Um, but, yeah. That's, for whatever reason, not showing. And I'm in fifth place. So... Ugh, oh, you can't hold the button. That's terrible. By the way, I've always hated these in arcades. Uh, mostly because it takes forever. And you never know if it's up or down, or what's select, or what's continue. I mean, it's just, it's just, just a pain in the asshole. But either way, it's boss to move. You've probably played this on your cell phone or somewhere else. Um, at least a clone of it, but it is pretty awesome. But either way, that's all for this. Um, I'm just going to upload it as it is. It's only eight minutes. It's short. It's boss to move. Um, unless the next few games are bad. Uh, PlayStation games usually take a whole lot longer. So, yeah, I'm fine with just a little eight-minute episode. But I will see you in the next episode. Oh, there's Tam Tam. So see you later. Hi, I'm Marek Dias, and welcome to an all-new Let's Play that started, like, super quick. The second I loaded the disc, it went crazy. Virgin Interactive. Are they even still around, or do they give up? Do they even have an airline anymore? So... Uh-oh, run from Army Shooty Man, business guy and jeans guy. I think they're terrorists. And he did. <laughs> he was dead. Oh, they fly, they shoot. They missile. Wait, really? So I'm going to guess that this is going to be like a jungle strike with Duke Nukem explosions everywhere.
So let's let's see how short this is. Oh, not a new game. We scramble. Let's see what the options are. Whoa. Enter password. Sure. Controller set. Okay. N no. Oh, that noise is like ear poison. Uh. Wow, these controls are funky as all hell. Wow. Wow, these are terrible. Uh. Wow, the. Okay, let's just go with the first one. Change weapon is select and triangle. Hold select and the a second trigger to look left or right. What the hell? I'm fine with strafe being there, because that's like the most sensical place. I don't like triangle fire weapon. I mean, L1 fire weapon would be good, but... S Ugh. Yeah, I guess I'm going to have to go for button. The the button forward, back, left, right. Except it's completely reversed from what I'm used to. So, wow. Yeah, I guess we'll just hope for the best. Because I'm already looking that this game is going to gonna be great. It's going to be real great. R really, really great. Let's scramble. Operation Urban Shield. Get behind the dark. I mean, what? No, this is terrible. And like the shattering glass. Is it frozen? Oh, please tell me this game doesn't work. Please tell me you don't work. Damn it, man. Come on. Well, uh, uh, nope, that's, oh, wow, this is, this is a thing, ugh, it's, it's reversed controls for whatever goddamn reason, let's get there quick, ow, tree, what are, okay, how do I shoot, this is this is the forward button. Ow! Damn it, man! Oh my god, this is terrible. Ugh! I hate these. Okay, he's he's bad. Suck a missile, bitch! What are we? In Central Park? Off course. You're off course. Shut up. Oh my god. We're going down. This controls, like, if you wanted to know what it's like to be a piece of sentient jello on a big patch of super slippery ice, that's the experience that this game gives. Also, the controls are terrible. The, no, the, this game was is terrible. Like, that control... Like, you you can't hit the trees, you can't go above the trees. Uh, this game was terrible. I mean, I don't even want to give it another try, because uh, this is... I guess we're, we're doing uh, a whole pack of just random garbage, because this was garbage. So this can go with Bust a Move. Ugh man. Bust a move isn't garbage, but this is garbage. Black Dawn. Hi, I'm Morak Dias. Back with an all-new Let's Play. Uh, I saw SNK, so I have an idea what this is. But, uh, yeah. Hopefully this is not another Bust a move or whatever. Dark Battle, Dark... Whatever, the Chopper game. Unforgettable Chopper. Ah! 
quite a sound you have there, sir. I wonder if this is in Japan. Very Japanese. Little, little hot there. Well done. I would certainly uh, study martial arts if uh, I could summon lightning like that. Fatal Fury, wild ambition. Up, oh, it's a Fatal Fury <sighs> game. I thought there was more to that. I don't know. Let's do arcade mode. Devastatingly hurt wolves? Sure. City wolves. They're a problem. Just cities covered in wolves. South Town, not Cape Town. Apparently it's New York, but it's called South Town. Ooh, it's now starring Terry Bogard. Oh, and Jeff and Andy. I guess Terry can't Bogard this entire game. Sir, Ripper and Hopper. And of course, geese. Can't forget geese. Haha, <laughs> got your iconic hat that you somehow grew into. Along with the jacket you also grew into. Don't leave your hat behind. Come on, you need your trucker cap. My garbage! Ah, just out in my Chinese pajamas. That strange boy left his hat on my sidewalk again. He's like Mini Hagar. We noticed the Buick sedan. Lovely interior. Ah, what a smooth ride in my Buick. Whoa, it says walk. That guy's clearly a lawbreaker. But again, it is New York. Okay, magic hat space. Whoa, those pants are a little too far up uh, his butt there. Apparently, the old man has a lot of change in his pockets. Either that or he has broken metal bones. You know, you could just shoot him. If you really wanted to kill him. I mean, really, that's, that's a pretty efficient way to kill somebody. I mean, not that you should be killing people. Oh, he was so nice to me. I'll exact my revenge by putting a quarter on the screen. This was my final fight. I always thought his hat just had an F on it. I didn't think it actually said Fatal Fury. 
he dead? Ten years after. Not later in a different alternative universe. It's the same universe. They want to let you know. Oh my. Li Shangfei. I don't know a lot of these characters. Ooh, Raiden's in it. And new battle characters. Oh man, I can't believe new battle characters is making a, a debut in this game. How great. Yes. It's a building. Also, sub Mortal Kombat music. Ugh, every time I see a Buick sedan, I go crazy. Ugh, my pajama neighbor. I will avenge him when I get around to it. This is a really long opening for an arcade game. Ugh. He definitely is going to go for a final fight on these streets of rage. It's an almost primal rage. Don't drop your bag. This opening is a real time killer's. After Pajama Man's life was Tekken, he's here to measure the caliber of his soul in maximum fury. Yeah, hold on. I got a, a, a broom handle. And, okay, that was pointless. Yeah, they have guns, dum dum. You can do punch them to death while they shoot you. Also, you brought fists to a stick and gunfight. Not really the smartest idea. Curses. Okay. So, uh, oh, and it goes right into it. So, of course, you have Terry, Joe, I don't know who Yamazaki is, Sugumi, I don't remember, Raiden is apparently not a thunder god, but a wrestler, Zhang Fei, nothing to do with Shang Hua at all, they're not nothing alike, of course, Geese, Toji, Billy, of course, Kim, my Shiranoi. And Andy. Well, let's do Mai. I always like Mai. Japan. Japan. South Town is pretty big if it also has Japan in it. Especially if uh, there's no good or evil, only the strong survive in South Town. Alright. I didn't expect this to be 3D. <laughs> Okay, that's kick. Uh, okay, there's that. Good, that's still there. Come on, hit him with it. I said hit him with it. Man, that does not have much range. Seriously? Also, this game is stiff as hell. Also, I don't know what's with that tumble roll. 
Ugh. I'm trying to do the fan throw. Okay, why did you do that? Why? Stop doing the roll! There we go, that's what I'm trying to do. Okay. Let's see. Ugh. Come on. Okay, that's a taunt. Also, a triangle is roll. Okay. Wow, th that really has no range compared to the other. Really? You're just gonna do little bitch hits? Damn it, man. It's also sad that she doesn't do Sir Sheranoi's secret. I mean, technically, that's sharing my secret, but... There we go. Now, come on. There we go. I'm actually amazed I was able to pull that off. I'm... I'm doing this all from memory, from the original, uh, well, not the original games. I played some of the 2D games. My cousin is a beast at them. Um, but, yeah. The, uh, I'm remembering it all from Maximum Fury, the, their 3D one. I thought that was the first 3D one they did. But this is literally, like, Virtual Fighter. Round one. Fight. Are you a fan? Thank you. You're a dick. This music does not make much sense. Get down. I was trying to do the special again. Because I think she has two specials, but that might just be later games, because this one does not look very technically advanced. Pretty good damage. Do the fan slaps. No, come on. You're a dick. You're being a dick. Yeah, the rolling is really annoying. The winner. The rolling is, like, super annoying. But I think that's just about all, because this will just be the same thing, rinse and repeat, about 8,000 times. Because there's going to be, of course, unlock characters and all sorts of weird stuff. So I'm not going to go crazy with this game. I mean, I could play a good amount of it, but... But, I mean... Really? You're going to start with two of those? Seriously. I hate power wave. 
off or something like that. Well, getting whooped by him. What the? Oh, I thought his hands were the other way. Okay, I like the Sonic the Hedgehog music that's going on with this. But I think we, we have enough. Yeah, that's enough of that. It's really sleepy and slow. It reminds me of... Okay, so first off, Fatal Fury is known for being like a quick, fast-paced uh, 2D fighter. So that's fine. But as a 3D fighter, it feels like Virtual Fighter. Like very slow, very stiff, um, very... Uh, just something's off about it. In fact, I've never even heard of this Fatal Fury, and my cousin has like a huge collection of just about every Fatal Fury game that's ever come out. Also, no gay cowboy. So, sorry, Kelsey Alice, no gay cowboy. Um, which he's great in later King of Fighters, the PS3 King of Fighters? No, PS2 King of Fighters. I think King of Fighters 11? Or 9? I don't remember. But, either way, I mean... It's, it's King of Fighters at the end of the day, but this is like a slowed down King of Fighters. And, I don't know. It's really, I don't know, it's not as good. Like, I, like, Tekken is way better, obviously. Soul Calibur is very tit for tat. This feels very, like, just throw your move at them and hope it sticks. Which, that's kind of a problem that I don't like about, like, Fatal Fury and other games like that. Um, the only one that I think is an exception in 2D is the Marvel vs. Capcom, because that's very, like, technical in what you do, what you have for balance, stuff like that. Um, this one, no. I mean, I can say that just from the two fights that I did, that it's a little more stiff and jaggedy, and the roll thing is just weird. Um, in the later one, Maximum Fury, they, you can, there's a whole set of, like, sidestep moves you can do, and the triggers normally put you up or down, or double tapping really fast, like faster than you normally do for moves, um, will make you uh, strafe left or right. But this one, not as much. Um, it feels very stiff. Uh, I don't particularly like it, uh, mostly because they're like even my basic chains that you can do in 2D don't work at all in this. Which I think is just a general failing on their part. But I think that's just about all. I'm just going to put this all together with everything else. But you'll see that anyway. So I'll see you in the next Let's Play.